Hello everyone, this is Miss Fatma and this is uh, a brief summary of Act 2, Scenes 2, 3 and 4 of Julius Caesar. So let's begin. In Act 2, Scene 2, the storm rages at Caesar's house. Like Brutus, Caesar has a troubled night. His wife Calipernia has dreamt about his murder three times. Other omens have been noted in the streets of Rome and Calipernia begs Caesar not to go to the capital as she is afraid of what the signs mean. Caesar maintains he is stronger than fate, saying danger knows full well that Caesar is more dangerous than he. And here we see that Caesar again dismisses the, all the omens and the signs that lead to his demise. However, he orders the priest to make a sacrifice to determine his success that day. And out of love for Calipernia, he agrees to stay at home. Decius, one of the conspirators, arrives to fetch Caesar. Caesar says he's not going because Calipernia saw uh, my statue. Uh, Calipernia saw my statue, which like a fountain with a hundred spouts, did run pure blood, and many lusty Romans came smiling and did bathe their hands in it. Decius informs Cass Caesar that there are plans to crown him at the Senate, and if he does not go because of his wife, he will seem cowardly. Of course, we know that Decius is one of the conspirators, and he wants to convince him to go so they can carry out the assassination. This is enough for Caesar to change his mind. The conspirators enter to escort him to the capital. In Act 2, Scene 2, Artemidas, okay, who knows about the conspirator, okay, reads the petition he wants to give to Caesar, warning him against the conspirators. So Artemidas has a letter with the names of all the conspirators, okay, and he wants to hand it over to Caesar before. Caesar enters the Senate uh, and warn him of what's going to happen to him. What do we learn from that? We learn that other people are aware of the plot and want to warn Caesar, okay? Not only the conspirators. Now, in Act 2, Scene 4, Portia has been told by Brutus about the plot. She struggles between her, her fears for her husband and her promise to Brutus to keep counsel and not to speak out. The Susei enter on his way to warn Caesar to befriend himself and Portia betrays her nerves as she questions him. Brutus has told Portia about the plot and trusts her enough to confide in her. Portia is finding it hard to keep her word and is very concerned that something will happen to Brutus. There are more plans to warn Caesar. Thank you very much. I hope this was useful and thank you very much for listening.